so welcome and today I'm going to be taking a look at our station of the week so this is made by Gaia Sun it's the first station uh, download he's made available on his shipwrights blog just gonna take a quick look around so in here we've got a hangar with several shuttles uh, shuttles are all docked up and obviously this is a pretty authentic looking Star Trek uh, Starbase so we're going to take a little look around the inside first, I think. Up we go. There we go. Moving into the main hall. And this is just amazing. I mean, I don't know what he used for reference to build this. But it's as I would imagine from the franchise. Got two turbo lifts using plex lifters. So this is a station. And uh, if we go through here, into the next main area, lots of room here. If people wanted to, people wanted to customize and add to it. There's a shop, so you can buy your blocks. On detonator. I'm not entirely sure why the power drain beams are here, but I might have a little look at that in a sec. Moving in here, we've got the uh, control center. Coming in under here, we've got another room. Lots of cool little rooms everywhere. I like that. Same on the other side. Right, let's go back out. So we're going to have to go down the turbo lift. Oh. <laughs> right, out we go. Take a little fly around. Now this thing's too big for me to actually load. But if I, re I reckon if I sort of go around at this distance, you should be able to get an idea of what we're dealing with. Now, before I end the video, I'm going to load one of the one of his one to one scale ships into this and fly it in just for the photo op but uh, as you can see this thing's big enough Gaiason says to fit a planet inside so <laughs> there you go guys <laughs> plenty of turrets fitted all the way around so here you go an authentic Star Trek dry dock another first for star made lots of people have uh, built big stations but I think I did see this in one of the Star Trek movies can't remember which one so yeah I'm gonna spawn in one of my uh, one of Gaia Sun's ships fly it into position and uh, go do a quick fly through there it is. Absolutely massive. An easily station of the week. All right, here we go. This will do. The one-to-one -one constitution refit by Gaia Sun. So that'll go. That'll match. So I've already uh, zapped the door open. Let's see if I can get in. Okay. Just get rid of this core. Let's move her into position, shall we? Oh, excellent. Press C. See, to be honest, I think this, this is fine. There was a comment about the alignment. And to be honest, I think it, it aligning the ship that you're working on is better than it aligning to the ship you're docking. Because to be honest, if you're going to be doing this authentic, you want to be inside it, really, don't you? In we go. 
Oh yeah. This is gonna look a bit strange. Come on, load it. <laughs> I'm on the edge of the draw distance. Come on. Load for me. <laughs> in we go. Ah, that's working. Right, I think I'm in the middle. A little bit to the left, okay. I don't know, let's push up. Uh, whoops. Well, what did I do? That's what I wanted to do. <coughs> now, where's the open door? Uh, uh, must be this way. Oh, that's glorious. Right, there we go. Now then. Hmm. <laughs> I can't seem to get the draw distance going on. Uh, uh, ah, there we go. Well, yeah. <laughs> it's massive. So there it is guys, can't quite get the draw distance to work out for me, but uh, there's the space dock, you want to download it, the link will be in the description. Thanks for watching and come back next week for Station of the Week and Ship of the Week along with next week's Star Made News. Thanks again, see you soon.